This is Sensei Seb. And this is Sensei Cody. Welcome to our home show, Dojo TVT edition. Oh yeah. Are you ready to rock down the lockdown? I know we are. I'm born ready. Welcome to our second edition of our home show, Dojo TVT class. Let's get started right away. Jumping jacks, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one, two, squats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Down low, ready. Push up all the way down. Hands come off. Push up. Two, three, four, five. One more, six. And mountain climbers, 20. And time on the back, bicycle twist, go. Awesome, stand it back up. So now the heart rate's going. We're just gonna get those hips warmed up a little bit. If you guys need some extra time, now's your time to pause it. Get some more stretching in that you guys feel you need. Um, but we are almost ready to go. So over toes up, toes down. One more time each side. Down, boom, and down. I'm feeling good. I hope you guys are feeling good too. We got a good one for you coming up. Let's get it on. We grab your weights, grab your cans. Round one is gonna look like this. We're gonna start with a jab cross. All right, we're gonna add 30 seconds of uppercut. So we're gonna be adding that to the combination. Okay, our final piece is gonna come back in. We're gonna rotate through with our hook punch and finish with a big bad cross. All right, from there, we're gonna be going down into our touch and switch. So when we touch and switch, you guys are gonna be going sideways, touch the ground in front, and on the switch, it's on the way up. Okay, watch your knees, okay? Don't wanna be twisting them, so you wanna make sure that you take your time on this. A little touch and switch. Now we may add a little beast mode in there. If you guys wanna add on a little extra, Burpee's gonna be our beast mode today. And then the final piece is gonna be a plank and row. So we're using your weight, we're using your can, Open up the feet, strong body. It's gonna be one, two, three, four. Pass it underneath, okay? Control the pass, because that's a good ab workout as well. Three, four, control on the side. All right, let's have some fun. Sensei Seb, are you ready? I'm born ready, Sensei, let's okay. do it. Okay, so we're gonna start off, put your favorite side forward. Very good, so we're gonna start. Jab one, cross two, and pull it back. All right, here we go. 30 seconds. Try to keep up with Sensei Seb in three, two, one, and go. Good stuff. So he's keeping those arms in front. He's got a good pace. Staying on his toes in between. Remember, you take it at your pace that you're comfortable with. We are going to be using a lot of weight for this one. You're going to start feeling them after a little bit. Looking good, Sensei. Looking good. You got 10 more seconds. We're gonna be getting into a speed round of 10 seconds soon. In five, four, three, two, one. Speed round, go, 10 seconds. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. That's it, almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent, all right. So now we're adding, so jab one, cross two, and we're gonna roll up into that uppercut and back. All right, you ready, Sensei? Yes, Sensei. All right, here we go, ready. 30 seconds on the clock in three, two, one, and go. Jab, cross, up, good. Jab, cross, up. Pop, 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 good. He's pushing off the ground with his uppercut to help get that power from the floor. Keep it going, keep it going. You guys are halfway through this one. Looking good, looking good. 
Almost there, guys. Almost there. You got five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and speed round. Go. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Very nice. Now we're going to finish it off. Here we go. Jab one, cross two, lift up. Now here's my favorite part. Drop back in, hook it again, and then kick it over for the cross. So that one you want to keep tight in. Bang, bang. All right, Sensei, let's do it up. So jab one, cross two, uppercut, reload, hook, and cross. All right, we got this one for a minute. Ready? And go. Jab, cross, up, hook, cross. Looking good, looking good. All right, we're killing it. Good, now his arms are in nice and tight. Right, he's keeping them in tight to the body so that he's pushing everything off of that core, off of that center. Keep it up, keep it up. And breathing constantly. Every time you breathe out, you're forced to breathe back in. So it's a good little trick to make sure you keep that energy up through the whole round. You're already past the halfway, Sensei. Keep it up. Oh yeah, 20 seconds. Almost there, almost there. Good, when you start Woo. feeling it in those shoulders, make sure those legs are working. All right, you're almost there, Sensei, almost there. You got five seconds left in five, four, three, two, and one. Fast hands, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And time, how are you feeling, Sensei? Oh, the arms. Woo. Feeling good. All right, here we go, 30 seconds of touch, switch. All right, here we go. So try to keep up in three, two, one, and go. That's it. Using your core to help turn the body. Looking good, looking good. That's 10 seconds down. I'm liking it. Halfway through, in about three seconds, since it says going into beast mode. Ready, Sensei, go! Burpee, switch, oh yeah! Again, burpee, switch! Almost there, one more, one more! And time! Woo! Oh, hell yeah! All right, grab onto your weight, you just need one at this point. Good, we're down in our push-up plank. Okay, so keeping that arm tight to the body, we're gonna do four rows, and then pass it underneath with control. Ready, and go, one minute. One, two, three, Four and under. One, two, three, four and under. And as Sensei said, still going. You're gonna notice he's got his feet apart to help keep that base strong. His hips are staying in the same spot. He's trying to keep his chest flat to the ground and his arm is coming in at the same angle every time. Keep it up, Sensei, keep it up. Halfway done. Almost there, almost there. Keep it going, 20 seconds. Keep breathing, keep breathing. We have 10 seconds. Race to the end, race to the end. In five, four, three, two, and one time. Awesome job, Sensei, an awesome job. You guys, you get your one minute break. Starting now, grab a sip of water. I'm gonna explain what's coming up next. So if you check out our board, we have our jab. Jab is first. We're gonna add on the cross. Then we're gonna be doing our third part is a front leg kick into a cross hook. Speed round, our uppercuts this time. And for our exercise for the legs, it's gonna be one big hop forward, Three little hop back. So a big hop, keeping low. One, two, three. Okay, now if you don't have the space to hop forward back, that's fine, just go in the spot. Beast mode is adding that burpee again. So we do our big one into the burpee, and then three little hops back. Okay, and the last exercise is gonna be that plank shoulder circuit. So with our weights, you're gonna come up. It's gonna be a lift, rotate, over, in, and under. 
All right, we're gonna be doing that on both sides. You ready, Sensei? Yes, Sensei. All right, we got five seconds left here. Good, so the first 30 seconds is a double jab. Here we go, ready? Let's do it. And go, jab, jab. Good, pop, pop. Now he's using his shoulder to help push that weight forward. But again, not overextending, not hyper extending that arm, keeping it tight. There we go, 15 seconds. Now our speed round is gonna be fast uppercuts. Coming up in 10 seconds. Good, here we go. Fast ones, uppercuts in three, two, one, go. Keeping it tight, rolling those shoulders. Let's go. Almost there, five, four, three, two, and one time. Good, adding the cross now. So jab, jab, and pull that arm back and dig into that cross. All right, pulling back to make sure you watch your shoulders. Here we go. Ready, three, two, one, and go. Jab, jab, cross. Jab, jab, cross. Jab, jab, cross. Good, focus on your breathing. 20 seconds, friends, 20 seconds. Remember, those, the weight's starting to get a little bit heavier. You gotta start using those legs. All right, five seconds before our speed round in three, two, one, and go. Fast uppercuts, keep it going. Roll left body, almost there in five, four, three, two, and one time. All right. We're adding on the kick cross hook. So it's jab, jab, cross. You're gonna be rocking your front leg, okay? So you can pivot, kick, come back, pivot, and pivot. So lots of pivoting on this one. All right, Sensei, you got this? Yes, Sensei. All right, so ready, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Jab, jab, cross, front leg, kick, cross, hook. Looking good, looking good. Jab, cross, front leg, kick, cross, hook. Always making sure those weights are coming back to the body. Excellent. Notice how Sensei is also rechambering his front leg every time he throws the kick. It helps him put his weight into that last part. Oh, oh, keep it going. Halfway through, 30 seconds left. Keep it up to Sensei, I hope, guys. Keep it going. He's making it look easy. Very <laughs> easy. 15 seconds. All right, we're almost there, guys. Five seconds till our final speed round of this one in three, two, one, and uppercuts go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two and one. All right, all right. Drop those weights of cans. Here we go. I'm gonna let you get set up sideways, Sensei. So one big hop forward, three controlled hops back in three, two, one, and go. Nice, staying low on the way back. Now the reason why his hands are up is also to keep his weight forward so he doesn't fall backwards as he's hopping back. 20 seconds. Awesome, Sensei. Keep those legs firing. Good. Pushing the hips. And then staying low on the way back. You have 10 more seconds. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. All right. Looking good. Looking good. Back down into that push up plank. Now we're going for our shoulder circuit. So here we go. Ready, guys? In three, two, one. You're going to lift up. Thumbs up. Rotate over, coming across in and under that arm. Other side, lifting up, thumbs up. Rotate, come across. Oh, trying to get me, Sensei. <laughs> Good, keep it going. Lots of control on this one. Try to keep that arm up and over. That's it. Good, body strong the whole time. It's like a plank. You have 30 seconds left. Breathing, Sensei, you're doing awesome. You guys keep breathing too. 15 seconds left. 
Almost there, almost there. Then you get your break. In five, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Awesome. Way to go, Sensei. Now you notice when the time was counting down from five, he wasn't giving up. He kept going, he kept pushing. That's what we like to see here. Okay, so on to our third round is going to start with a cross hook. Now we're gonna add in a little bit of ducking and weaving. Okay, we're gonna come back into our cross and we're gonna add some knees and some of those kicks again. Okay, now speed round for this one is gonna be straight techniques and uppercuts. It's a little bit of freestyle on this one, whatever you're feeling for it, okay? And for our exercise, for our squat and pop. So the squat and pop is gonna be a wide squat, pop at the top, pop at the top. All right, now, if you guys are going beast mode, the pop is coming down and in. Okay. Whew. Hope you guys are feeling as much as I am right now. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing awesome, Sensei. All right, so we're going to start into the cross hook in three, two, one, and go. Cross <laughs> hook. Good. Using that body to turn him over. Good job. Good job. And boom. Now focusing every time you're punching too about moving your shoulders, stay in unison with those hips. In 10 seconds, we're going speed round, little freestyle speed round. Straight and uppercuts in five, four, three, two, and one. Here we go, ready to go, 10 seconds. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Oops. Here we go, five, four, three, Two and one, very nice. Okay, so now we're gonna add in a little duck and weaving, cross hook. As you pull the hook back, come underneath, turn the shoulder one. Come underneath, turn the shoulder two. Finish over on that cross. All right, Sensei, let's do it up. Here we go, ready, and go. Cross, hook, duck, weave. Cross, hook, duck, weave, kick it. Very good, very good. All right, we're almost there. 15 seconds left. Keep it up, keep it up. We got our speed round coming up in five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Here we go, 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Time, good stuff. Okay, we're gonna add on the knee strike and the kick. So it's cross, hook, duck, weave, cross. Now we're gonna go with the same one. So as you pull this cross back, there's your knee. Come back, throw the kick to finish, front leg. All right, Sensei, it's your time to shine. Okay, here we go. So let's do it, go. Cross, hook, duck, weave, cross, knee, and kick. Good stuff. Back, back, under, over, cross, knee, kick. Good. Notice how after that knee stretch, he's always coming back into that pivot to make sure that he's set up for a proper kick. You want to pivot it over so you can get your hips engaged into the kick. Halfway through, halfway through. Keep breathing. At any moment, if you guys need a little breather on this one, you just take a couple extra bounces. Okay, Sensei's keeping a fast pace for you guys. You got 15 seconds, 15 seconds. All right, speed round in five, four, three, two, one, and go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and time. All right, looking good. So now we have 30 seconds of our squat and pop at the top. All right, Sensei, you ready? Yes, Sensei. In three, two, one, and go. Squat, pop. A little squat, a little pop. He's still smiling. Always. I might have to push it a little quicker. <laughs> Five pounds has never felt so heavy. <laughs> 
people were probably looking at those five pounds going, oh, that's gonna be easy. Mm -hmm. All right, we got 10 seconds left, Sensei. Beast mode. Oh, and down. Oh, oh, yes, yeah. yes, yeah, there you go. Hutsa, three, two, one. <laughs> oh, and <laughs> <laughs> All right, you know what, at least we're having fun, right? Okay, for this next one, we're gonna use the cans for it. You guys can use your weights. But what we're gonna be doing with these ones, uh, since why don't you grab the cans? We'll do this one together. All right, so get in enough apart that you guys have a little bit of space to move those feet. Okay, feet are on the outside to start. All right, so we're going for a minute. You ready? This is it. Go up, down, over. Good. Stop. Very nice pace, keeping the fingertips forward to make sure that you're showing, you have your balance. Keep breathing. That's 20 seconds down. Ain't no thing. Yeah, you're having fun at home. I know I'm having fun right now. Oh, oh yeah, it's burning. <laughs> Keep it going, guys. Keep it going. Almost there. You guys have 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Keep making those arches. 10 seconds. Almost there. Almost there. Five, four. Three, two, and time. Woo! All right. Round number three. Finished. Okay, so our next round and our final round of this one is going to be starting off with a jab into our lead leg kick. Then we're gonna hit up our cross for the next one. The last piece is going to be a switch knee into a finishing cross. After that, we got our squat and side jump. So our squat side jump is gonna be here. Drop, and you're gonna bring your outside foot in to help you get to the side. Squat, outside foot in as you're doing that jump, okay? If you guys have bad ankles, don't do the side hop, okay? You can do a straight hop or a regular one on the spot. Then we got one more ab circuit to finish. All right, Sensei, we got 10 seconds here. So we're gonna start with our jab into our lead leg kick. Now you can do just a lean back on the kick with the pivot, or you can do a step up kick. But I finish, it's up to you. Jab into the kick, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Front hand, front leg. Bop, bop. Bop, bop. Now regardless of if he's doing his lean back or his step up, you're still working that pivot. Making sure you're going heel to heel if you're doing the step up. Don't cross your feet. All right, you want to keep that nice straight line, just like Sensei said. All right, so we got a freestyle speed round in three, two, one, and go. Ten seconds. Pa, 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 pa. You can do anything on this one, Sensei. We got five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and time. Good stuff. So we're adding on the cross. So jab one, kick two, land forward, pivot three, into that cross. All right, here we go, Sensei, ready? Three, two, one, and go. Jab, kick, cross. Jab, kick, cross. Jab, kick, cross. Good, focusing on those pivots. For the kick and after the kick. 15 seconds. All right, freestyle coming up in five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 4. Wait, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Time. Good stuff. Okay, finishing off now. Final piece. Jab. Kick, cross. Now we're going for a switch knee and to a cross. So when you switch, you're just switching both feet and then driving the, that front knee in into your cross. All right, Sensa, we're almost there. It's our final minute for the hands. Ready? Three, 
two, one, and go. Jab, shake, cross, switch, knee, cross. Beauty, beauty. Jab, shake, cross, switch, knee, and cross. Now notice he's traveling a little bit. Okay, that's allowed if you have the space. Boom, boom. If you don't have the space, do that switch back to make sure that you don't travel too far. Keep it up, keep it up. You're feeling it. Halfway done, halfway done. You're almost there. Woo so again, remember guys, these weights are starting to get heavier and heavier. So if you need to take a second, shake them off, shake them off. If it's all way too much of the weights, you guys can put them down. Just do some freestyle in the, in the air with it. 10 seconds left. Speed round coming up in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and time. All right, ten, six. Okay, so we're into our leg exercise. Squat and pop across. So you got this. Thirty seconds. Ready? Three, two, one, and go. Nice and low, push off those legs. Have that outside leg really working for you. Oh, you did that <laughs> keep it going, keep it going. 15 seconds. Nice, control the landing. Just like Sente said, control that landing. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Okay, final lap, please, Sensei. Grab those hands. Now, the last one was abs, and you would have felt it a little bit in the hips as well. This one, we're going to take it away from those hips. It's going to be going in and out. In and out. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, and go. Now, it's okay to move your hands a little bit to get that pivot if you guys need to, okay? Or you can just twist the body in, okay? Depending on what your body likes to do. We have a very fast pace going, Sensei. I know. You are on fire. Keep, keep it up to you, Sensei. Oh, I thought I was keeping it up to you. <laughs> keep it going, guys. Halfway oh, through. That was what you were hoping I was gonna say, 10 seconds, eh? Keep it going, keep it going. Almost there. Ah, 15 seconds! Almost, almost! 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, down! Looking good. Okay. You guys are killing it. That is it for the main rounds. Now we get to have a little bit of fun for our final finish. Yeah. All right, Sensei, set. You ready to rock? Yes, Sensei. All right. Assume the position. Now, we're going to offset a little bit so we don't kick each other during some of these. So, Sensei, I'll have you guys move back here. Uh, step. Excellent. Okay, so they're going to be 30 seconds at a time. We are going to be going fast and furious. Keep it up with us. Are you guys ready? Yes, Sensei. You all ready? Here we go. Starting with the fire hydrant in three, two, one, and go. Up, up, up. Now try to keep that knee in line with your other knee as you're rocking it up to that hip. That's 10 seconds down. Here we go. Support the smile while you're doing these. Almost there. 10 more seconds. Now on the next 30 seconds, Sensei Sam's gonna keep this going like this. If anybody is working on the modifications so the hips are not there, then that's gonna follow Sensei Sam. Otherwise, if your hips are good, you're rocking those kicks. All right, right up to the side, try to keep that knee exactly where it is. Keep it going. Don't forget to breathe. 15 seconds left. Ooh, we're feeling the burn Ooh. already. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. In tight, kicking up and back. 
Thinking about leading with that heel. Get a good squeeze in the glutes at the top. Now you can do small circles, you can do big circles, it's up to you. 10 more seconds. And we're switching directions, Sensei. Woo. Five, four, three, two, one other direction. Oh, this is where it really starts to feel. I'm feeling it, Sensei. Oh, feeling good. Almost there. 20 seconds. Keep your whole circle. 15 left. 10 seconds. They're going by fast now. Right? We gotta trick ourselves. <laughs> In five, four, three, two, and one. And time. All right, quick little break. We're gonna be giving you guys 10 more seconds and then we're gonna start our next round. Now, the one thing I forgot to tell you guys is that um, the, the second side, you're gonna feel the first side a little bit. So have fun. Here we go. Ready? In three. Two, one, and go! Fire hydrants. Let me breathe. 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 Your hips are not still there. Otherwise, you got to follow me. Ready? And go. Keep it out. Keep breathing. You got to breathe through that, that burn. Almost there. Keeping the knee where it is. Just extending the leg. Pulling it back. 10 seconds. Keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. Five. Four. Three, two, and one. Kick it out the back. Up, in, up, in, up, in. Get that good squeeze at the top. If you guys want more squeeze at the top, think about that heel. Get the, the lead at the top there. Push the heel up. Ten seconds, and we're into our circles. Three, two, one, and... <laughs> All right, guys, keep pushing. We're almost there. 15 seconds.